this is Nadine with Happy Eating Healthy. Today I'm going to show you a really easy side dish. It's called Cheesy Potatoes. It has four ingredients. The first one is two cups of mashed potatoes. Now to prepare your mashed potatoes, you can boil them, you can cook them in a pressure cooker, you can even use instant potatoes, but you need to have two cups or enough for four servings of mashed potatoes. The next thing you need is one fourth pound of Colby Jack cheese. And you also need an egg. Those three ingredients are going to be mixed together and then we're going to sprinkle some paprika on top of it. So let's get started. I have my bowl here and I've already sprayed it down with um, vegetable oil. All I'm going to do is I'm going to stick in my mashed potatoes. I mix it right in the pan I'm going to bake it in. To that I want to add my cheese and my egg. And I want to chop that egg up. Now all I need to do is stir this together. Don't worry if the cheese isn't melted because you haven't cooked it yet. When you get done cooking this, the cheese will be completely melted in. Right now we're just mixing it in. My potatoes are still a little warm. So the cheese is melting a little bit on mine. If you start with cold potatoes, then your cheese will not melt at all. So it's going to really depend on what you start with. Alright, I have that mixed in. Main thing is to make sure that it's evenly distributed. Now I just want to smooth this out. Get all that off. Smooth it out so it looks a little bit nicer. And now I'm just going to sprinkle it with paprika. So I just sprinkle on top. I don't even measure out the paprika. I just sprinkle it on top. Now all you're going to do is heat this up. So I'm going to put a lid on it. I'm now going to stick these potatoes in the oven, 375 degrees, and they're going to cook for a half an hour. That's going to be enough for them to heat thoroughly through. And that's all there is to it. See how easy? Be back in a half an hour when the potatoes are done cooking. Our potatoes just finished cooking, so we're ready to take them out of the oven. Here is our creamy, cheesy potatoes. So I have the calorie count to this figured out for one half cup of the potatoes. So when I measure it on my plate, I want to actually use a measuring cup to measure it. Here's my plate, and I'm going to have this, these delicious potatoes with my garlic lemon chicken with thyme. So I need to get my potatoes and I'm just going to scoop a half a cup into my container. And then I can just plop it right on the plate. And if I want to try to curve the edges a little bit, I can do that. And now I have a lovely dinner display. I actually stuck my salad on here, but if I wanted to, I could have put it there to add a little bit more color to the plate. But for convenience, I didn't. But what I will do to add color is I will stick my bowl of apricots on there and then have my salad on the side. So this meal that I'm having with the chicken and the side dish of the potatoes is going to be well under my 600 calories, um, even after adding the fruit and the salad. Now these potatoes, they could go with many different dishes. These potatoes are a little bit higher in calories. Um, 
if you use the Yukon potatoes, which the recipe calls for, you're going to come in for a serving at 179 calories. If you use other potatoes, it might be a little bit higher, a little bit lower. I actually today, because I was kind of in a hurry, I used instant potatoes. And instant potatoes, when I do it with instant potatoes, it comes in at 203 calories. So it's a little bit more calories when you use the instant potatoes. But for me, because I had just gotten home from work, it was a lot quicker. I didn't want to uh, crack some potatoes and then mash them to make this, so I used instant. Uh, and it only added about 30 calories more. So it's up to you which way you want to do it. E anyways, fine. So, enjoy your cheesy potatoes. This is Nadine with Happy Eating Healthy. Mm -hmm.